Now, although you don't need any subscription plan or anything like that to get Hubitat Dashboard on your phone or your tablet or device, it is a little bit cumbersome, so I made this video to help you guys out. So once you already have your dashboard set up inside of Hubitat, all you need to do is go into Apps, then head on down to Dashboard, and scroll right to the bottom and you're going to get a couple of links here. There's legacy links and uh, dashboard direct links. Then go ahead and click on the cloud link to dashboard and you'll see this big address that'll pop up here. Next, you're probably gonna wanna copy and paste that link into email or text or something like that because as you see, it's uh, quite the jumble of characters. So email that or send it however you want to uh, whatever portable device you wanna put that on and I'll show you how to add it there. All right, so once you have the Hubitat app installed on whatever device that you want. Go into Hubitat, let that thing boot up, and then once you, uh, whatever default it uh, opens up to, go to settings, enable custom dashboard, and then paste that whole link that we got earlier into there. Then you can click on dashboard after you've done that, and your device and all its goodies are going to show up there. If you do want this resized and stuff, that's a different topic, but you can resize, so as you see in the background, all of my same devices are on there and they do resize on my device according to the size of tablet. And that is enableable in the dashboard settings. If you do have a Hubitat specific question, leave it in the comments down below because I'm always uh, looking to play with this device and add more features for myself, so I do enjoy kind of tinkering around with it. Till next time, take care.